Hi there, this is Ranjit and I have the Moto G4 with me and in this uh, video we will be doing the gaming review and I'm just going to play these four games. We'll start with a casual game that is known as Unkill and later on we'll quickly move to heavy games and we'll also check the temperatures later on uh, because uh, if you recall the Moto G4 uh, Plus uh, did exhibit uh, quite a bit of heating uh, with extended gaming. So let's test that and let's start with Unkilled. And again, we're getting the water effects as you can see. So everything is getting rendered. Water run. And as you can see, it's running this game without any issues. I don't think so. We'll have any problems running this game. So let's do one thing. Let's get out of this game and move to some heavier games and let's see how it handles uh, them as you can see it's handling this one fine let's get out of this one and now uh, let's uh, move to another game that is implosion and this is uh, supposed to be a heavy game let's see how it handles it Which so this is uh, implosion and as you can see it's running well it's happening here. Avalon, you need to calibrate offensive pathways and sync your standard and heavy attacks regarding the audio uh, it has just one speaker that's here but uh, as you can hear it's actually good quality speaker so no complaints there And as you can see, a lot of action going on still. It's handling it without any issues. So you shouldn't have a problem playing even this uh, implosion game. Avalon, remember how I. As you can see, it's playing it fine without any issues. So let's get out of this game also. Let's move to other games now. And now I'm going to play Asphalt 8. And I'm going to go play it at the highest graphics settings. So this is the Tokyo level. And I've set the graphics to highest graphics setting. And as you can see, we are getting the water effects. That means all the graphics are getting rendered. And this Moto G4 is sort of very similar to the G4 Plus. This one does not have a fingerprint scanner. And it has a 13 megapixel camera instead of a 16 megapixel that is found on the G4 Plus. And surprisingly as you can see it's running this game very well. All graphics are getting rendered. And it's running very smooth in fact. We will also play one more game later on that is Nova 3 after this one to see if it exhibits any uh, lagginess or overheating issues. So this level is uh, almost done now and it's been 12 minutes since we were gaming let's look at the temperatures the surface temperature around this area is 27.5 as you can see let's look on the screen uh, the screen is going about 41.42 uh, it is touching as you can see it did go 42.6 was the max th that we registered on the screen let's look at the back and the back is uh, not that hot as i've uh, mentioned to you guys it's not getting that hot surprisingly Whereas the G4 Plus went really high. So about 42-ish on the back also. Uh, let's now quickly exit this Asphalt 8 and uh, jump to Nova 3 to see uh, how it performs. 
so this is uh, Nova 3 and let's see how it handles this one now. Let's see. And I don't notice that much lag in this game as of now. And as you can see, it's handling even this Nova 3 really well. So that's a good sign. Because most of the smartphones, they either lag in uh, Nova 3 or Asphalt 8 when I do heavy gaming. But here, as you can see, uh, it's a good experience with Nova 3. As you can see, lots of action going on. Then also, I don't notice any lagginess. So, we have finished this level of uh, Nova 3 also. And the best part was that there is no lag. Let's look at the temperatures now. It's been just over 15 minutes since we started this gaming session. And again, the ambient temperature around this area, 27.5. So on the screen, it's again about that 43 dead touch max, 43.5, 43, yeah. About 43.5 is what we are registering around the earpiece. That's the max that we are seeing, 43.5. Let's look at the back. And here it's about 14. Here the Motorola logo, let's see. It was getting a bit warm. Strangely, it's not getting that hot, but this feels a little bit warm to hold. So on the back again, just 40-ish, it's registering. That's strange. It did go till 42 with Asphalt 8. So again, uh, very surprising results uh, because the Moto G4 Plus did heat considerably more. It went till about 46 degrees. Uh, uh, Celsius so definitely it feels a little bit warm to touch but it is not getting very hot as you can see max that it touched was about 43.5 degrees Celsius so what do I feel about the gaming with this Moto G4 as you have seen uh, the gaming performance was actually really good we played uh, heavy games like Nova 3 Asphalt 8 and even Implosion and the gaming performance was actually really good and yes it does get a bit warm it can touch about 43.5 degrees celsius but strangely it didn't get as hot as the moto g4 plus did so i feel uh, it's a good device for the price of around 12,500 for gaming again i'll also be posting the full in-depth review for this uh, device in the next couple of weeks so if you have any specific question do post them in the youtube comments below and i'll try to include them in my review thanks for watching this is ranjit and i hope to see you in my next video